everyone! Good day! It is already our week 7 and it's all about presentation of cereals and starches. So, let us discuss now the techniques. Cooking times for pasta as one of the most common kind of starchy foods differ for every size and shape, trimming for kind of flour used, and the moisture content. Also, the general rule for cooking pasta in boiling water is for one pound of pasta, use one gallon of water, one teaspoon of salt, and one teaspoon of oil should be observed. Techniques in preparation of pasta Before plating to achieve a palatable and attractive pasta, here are the things that we need to follow. First, pasta is best if cooked and served immediately. Try to cook pasta upon order. Next, provide enough water in the pasta pot which allows it plenty of room to cook and keep it from sticking. Third, avoid paraboiling the pasta. Do not go halfway. Always choose pasta that suits your needs. If the pasta is used as an ingredient in a recipe, it should be slightly undercooked. If pasta is to be served immediately, just drain and do not rinse in cold water. If the pasta is to be used in a cold salad, it should be ready to be incorporated in the recipe as soon as it is cold. Next, if pasta is to be held, toss gently with a small amount of oil to keep it from sticking. Measure portions into mounds on trees, cover with plastic film, and refrigerate until serving time. Lastly, to serve, place the desired number of portions in a china cup and immerse in simmering water to the heat. Drain, plate, and add the sauce. Now, for the second subtopic, we will discuss how to plate the pasta like a pro. This presentation for long pasta can be complicated to work either with or without sauce added all over the pasta. To make it possible, you will need to use ladle and a carving fork. If you don't have it, you may use tong. So here is the last subtopic, the 6 ideas for prettier pasta. Cooking cereals and starch dishes like pasta for your loved ones make it special but adding extremely easy trick for your plating presentation makes it more extraordinary.
So that's it everyone. Thank you everyone for watching and be safe. Disclaimer, the content was not mine. It is was from the module of SDO of Kalaokan written by Fortuna Kaliser and some of the pictures were from different websites.